Cooper with the 22 News Storm Team. Let's take a look at our Greenfield live camera. We could see a lot of cloud cover this morning, and it's going to persist throughout the day. And taking a look at our Chicopee live camera, similar views. We're seeing lots of cloud cover. Unfortunately, this is bringing showers throughout the day today and through tomorrow as well. Thankfully, it does dry up by the time we get to Halloween. And we'll show you on our 22 News Storm Team forecast focus for today, tomorrow, and on Halloween. Today we're seeing rainy and much cooler temperatures than we saw yesterday, mainly in the 40s and the 50s, as we saw almost 80 degree temperatures in Springfield yesterday. And coming up to tomorrow, we're seeing showers dry up in the evening, thankfully, just in time for Halloween, which is going to be dry, but it's definitely not going to be warm. Seeing temperatures dip down into the 30s as we go into the evening. Our 22 News Storm Team ESP live Doppler radar showing us the, a little bit of activity right now. I think there's just a lot of moisture in the air because we are getting those showers later today. We're really expecting those more so throughout the later parts of the morning. We'll show you why on a 22 news storm team clouds and radar. We can see this massive storms moving eastward towards Western Massachusetts and through New England. We aren't getting a lot of that cloud cover right now. We're not getting too much in terms of storms right now. We're going to be getting those showers mainly later in the morning and all throughout the afternoon. Temperatures now mainly in the high 40s, low 50s, 52 in Southwick, 50 in Amherst, Berkshire County sitting more in the mid to low 40s, getting a reading of 48 in Monterey and 44 in Adams. Some more temperatures for you, South Hadley and Agawam at 51, Wendell at 48, Berkshire County mainly again in those mid to low 40s, 46 in Stockbridge and 44 in Lanesboro. Our temperature cast throughout the day, not showing too much difference. Around 11 a.m. today, we're getting even some lower temperatures as we go towards 4 p.m. Our highs, not that high, mainly in the mid to high 40s as we go on throughout the day. Could peak at 50, like we're seeing those temperatures this morning. Tonight, we're not seeing much fluctuation at all between the mid to high 40s for our lows this evening, and showers are going to be persistent throughout the night going into Monday as well. And here's our 22 News Storm Team rainfall forecast for this evening, and we'll show you a little bit of tomorrow too. Around 7 a.m. this morning, not, not a lot of rain to speak of, but as we get towards 10 a.m., we could start seeing that's when most of Western Massachusetts is going to start being a Affected, getting close to close of a tenth of an inch in most places and when it really picks up is the later parts of the day we could see totals of about a quarter of, it, quarter of an inch to almost half an inch in most places but when we're getting the most rainfall is mainly going to be on Monday we can see Monday morning Springfield's uh, estimated to be at about half an inch North Adams at, um, at more than three quarters of an inch and as we go on through the day on Monday thankfully around 7 p.m. the rain does stop there but we are getting lots Lots of higher rainfall totals, especially in Berkshire County, in northern parts of Berkshire County more so. Isolated, isolated rainfall totals could get to over an inch in some places. Here's a look at our 22 New Storm Team 7-day forecast. Halloween right around the corner. Thankfully, it does remain dry for all those trick-or-treaters out there, but we do have showers today and tomorrow that we have to deal with before we get to go eat all that sweet candy. Today we do have a high of 50 with our showers throughout the day. Only bumps up to 52 tomorrow as we're going to get to some more normal temperatures throughout this week. And on Tuesday, Halloween, I hope everyone has costumes with layers because the low for Tuesday night is 31. So it's not exactly going to be warm, but thankfully it is going to be dry. Rain, the next rain chance throughout the week is only going to be on Wednesday, and that's mainly going to be in the later part of the day with a high of 47. And then we're sticking to the mid to high 50s for the rest of the week. And if you want to stay up to date with all of our latest forecasts and the rain chances for today and tomorrow, you can check out our website, wwlp.com, or get your phone out and download the free 22 News mobile app.